Alrighty, well today this morning starting in the 50s in the coastal bend, which means a difference in the coffee that you're going to be grabbing, at least if you want to change it up. It's cold enough for a hand warmer. I kept it on hand warmer and not hot because, well, we're South Texans, and for some, this may not be that cold. Temps across the coastal bend, 72 out in Port Aransas, so a little warmer along the coast. However, mostly everybody else waking up to the 50s, 54 out in Alice. I am jealous of you. Winds from the northwest, that's thanks to the cold front that moved through yesterday, sending in those north westerly winds between 5 to 10 mile per hours right now across the coastal bend, but this will pick on up throughout our day, reaching close to 30 miles per hour later on in some areas. Radar showing us a few advisories. We've got a small craft advisory as well as a gale advisory in effect until tomorrow early morning at 1 a.m. We've also got a wind advisory just north, a little bit of rock port. And so again, those winds sticking with us throughout our day today, that'll expire tonight at 7 p.m. Okay, taking a look at at this uh, cold front that moved through the coastal bend yesterday. It's now east of us uh, along Panama City, Montgomery, Alabama, sending in some heavy showers to them. We saw that uh, yesterday in Houston as well as Louisiana. For us, however, thankfully, we are now just enjoying the after effects of that cold front that moved through. So that is going to keep us dry today. When I say dry, I don't mean no rain. I mean dry as in no humidity. 83 degrees later on today at 3 p.m. Now, 83 may sound hot, but that is not a humid 83. That is a dry 83. So it's going to feel really, really nice by tonight. 74 degrees when you're going to sleep and we'll wake up again to some of those even colder temps than what we're seeing this morning. 57 in Corpus Christi, 55 up in Beeville, 51 out in Freer. So again, tomorrow is going to be another day. You want to grab that sweater as you're heading out the door. And that is thanks to these dew points staying low in the 30s and 40s. Again, dew points are a measure of the moisture that is in the air. So this means no humidity as we enter the weekend. That'll stick with us. John Thomas said dew points, humidity. What's that looking like for Sunday? Well, Sunday you see this picks on up into the 50s. Now our our, our meter here is showing us that that is comfortable. It's not going to be as cold as it is the next few days. It'll still feel comfortable, but you see that'll just continue to pick on up as we enter our next work week. Humidity returns by Monday. It won't be as sticky, but it will be stickier than it is today. All right, so your Halloween forecast, 76 degrees. It'll be nice, a slight little breeze, but again, that drier air is still going to be with us. Humidity making somewhat of a small return. Wind southeast between 5 to 15 mile per hour, but if you ask me, at least at least it's not raining. I feel like it always rains on Halloween. That is not the case this year. Sunny lows in the 60s, highs in 85. Again, a dry 85, so that is not going to be sticky. It's going to be a nice day to be walking about in your neighborhood. Staying in the 60s as we enter next week for your lows. Humidity making a return by Monday into Tuesday. So definitely want to enjoy the rest of the day today and our weekend. John Thomas, Barbie.